Um, now, I don't know if you know, but uh, Call of Duty just had their big Call of Duty championships this weekend here in L.A. where they had a million dollar uh, prize pool with eight teams. They didn't call me. Oh. <laughs> um, what are your thoughts on now that these guys, you know, people that play video games are now considered pro gamers? Like uh, you being a professional athlete, what are your thoughts on that? Well, I, I think they take the time off to, to, to be as good as possible um, from practicing. And, you got to play enough. You got to play enough to really be as good. And phone games were... You can't play it the first or second time and really understand and be a professional, very professional craft at this game. You know, because so many different things to learn and do. Um, so I think that's well deserved. Now, being that you're, you're gaming yourself, how familiar are you with the whole esports phenomenon? As you can tell, the Call of Duty Championships, there's other games out there that have leagues with major league gaming. What are your thoughts on esports? Now, I, I'm not that good. <laughs> Man, if I work at it, I probably can catch up. But no, I think it's cool. I think it's competitive. Um, I'm big into and competing. Um, I think so, I think I think it makes it fun, you know, for everybody kind of around and get involved. Now, obviously, there's you know team game. What are the similarities you see between playing Call of Duty in the pros and then playing uh, you know in real life? Um, just just communication. It's very similar. Communication, playing as one, as a group, um, to get one goal accomplished. You know, if there's one link link in the group. <laughs> kind of affects the team, which you need. You need a good team. So it's very similar to actually pro ball. Now, obviously, eSports is a new thing. If eSports was around when you were younger, was that something that maybe would have swayed you, or was it football all the way? Man, I've been tough one, man. Is it right to do both? Deion Sanders did it. <laughs> eSports e and pro sports. So McCoy, you, you might be the first one. There you go. Now, do you ever go online and play against random people, let people know they're playing against the Shady McCoy, no. do you kind of keep a low pro? I don't do that. Because if they're on my team, I might want them focusing on, on playing instead of asking me questions, you know, about, about real football. Now, do you you only play uh, in parties or by yourself, um, like with friends, like, or do you just play with random people sometimes? I do everything, from random to friends um, to one-on-ones, I do everything. And then how, how do you think you fare against, like, the, the, the randoms out there in the, on the I, online? I don't, do, I don't do bad. Now, the, the guys that rank the highest, I mean, it, you know, sometimes you get to them and they're really 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 good for the most part man I, I handle myself pretty well now last question obviously you're a pro bowl this year now when you're on the field do you ever feel like you're actually in a video game when you're out there with the eagles i mean some of the moves you know are pretty pretty uh sometimes, spectacular sometimes when you it's like you're in a groove man everything you do is working spinning hopping jumping back cutting back you feel like in the game sometimes it's very rare though very rare Nice, man. Now, uh, obviously, off-season, you do nothing fun this off-season? You know, when are you going to kind of get back to, uh, to hardcore training? I'm actually training now. You know, slowly getting into it, but getting into it for sure. Uh, still ready for another dominant year. Predictions for the 2014-2015 for the season? Only one. Hopefully the championship. Hopefully the Super Bowl.